First of all, let me tell you that I'm not the type of person to do something like this. I'm not really sure what's going to come of it, but I figured I'd give it a chance. I'm not going to tell you my whole life story, or even my name for right now, but I will tell you a little about myself. I just graduated from college this past spring. I enjoy what I do, but teaching takes up a lot of time and energy. Because of this, I can't go out often during the school week. I do miss college, but I'm adjusting to this new stage of life that I'm in. Truthfully speaking, I'd prefer not to talk about myself, but I guess I have to for these purposes. As far as my personality goes, I'm pretty laid back. Shy at first, but easygoing for the most part. Long walks on the beach are my favorite. I know that's not original in the least bit, but it's true. If you want to win my heart over, tell me your feelings while walking with me along the sandy shore. I love to laugh and hang out with friends and family. I also love helping others, whether it's through a volunteer effort or if they're my students. I try not to take myself or life too seriously and tend to have a positive outlook on life. Some other hobbies are dancing, working out, teaching, reading, cooking, taking road trips, and running. I'm a positive person, so I don't really hate much of anything. I barely use that word, but if there's one thing in this world that I hate, it's a cheater. If you have a good girl, there is no reason for you to be on this dating website. And if you are on here searching for that easy fuck, maybe you should double check and make sure 
that the woman you are trying to seduce isn't friends with your current wife. As if hiding pictures from upstairs into the basement of you and your significant other is going to stop a female from finding out you're in a relationship. What else can I say? Basically, I just joined this site out of boredom. We'll see if anything good comes out of it. I've never tried online dating before, and I've never helped a friend catch their boyfriend cheating either. I try to be open-minded about most things, and I figure you have to be willing to see what else is out there. I'd say more about myself, but come on. You gotta leave something to the imagination, right? After all, less is more. If you're looking for a good girl that's going to live the happy family, white picket fence lifestyle with three kids and a Labrador retriever, you can skip my page and move on to the next female. The truth is, I don't believe in true love. That's only for the movies. I'm a female, which means I'm a blood-sucking creature that's only here to rip your heart out. But you guys should know that we can be very loving and sweet too. Just don't give us a reason to show our crazy side based on something stupid like cheating. There's no such thing as a good girl out there. We're all a bunch of bitches that don't know what we want. It's the hard truth. We are the reason you go out to the bar and party. We are the reason you buy nice cars and get a haircut every two weeks. Murder is the least evil we could actually do. We never know what we want other than a good time. So if that's what you're trying to do and possibly share a nice night with me, message me. And if you're looking at my page interested in me, but already have a significant other, then I'd think twice about my next move if I were you. Love what you have, because you probably have more than most people do. But if you don't give a fuck about anything that I just said, well then who knows? Maybe you'll be my next arrangement.